And good morning, everybody. Thank you for joining us for this Friday morning, our six o'clock hour on the start of hurricane season. We're looking at uh, red flags behind us, which is indicative of uh, a hurricane warning on uh, the beaches. That's right. It's a good thing that we're not actually watching anything right now. But of course, this was as the storm made landfall in Florida. This was yeah. Alberto that we were talking about. And of course, it took that turn and did not impact us. But this is what we we're preparing for. If this could happen to us during hurricane Actually, season. it seems to have caused a lot more damage as it moved inland and up toward uh, uh, states uh, uh, north of, of Florida. Yeah, and people did get some damage there. But you've yeah. always got people who will use the waves to surf, as we see there. All right. Uh, anyway, uh, we just had uh, the uh, uh, Cal what is that? Uh, Colorado State come out with their new uh, information. They say it's going to be probably an average season this year. Yeah, and it is hurricane season. We wanted to explain the difference between a warning and a watch. A watch has the possibility for winds of at least 74 miles per hour within 48 hours. A warning is 74 miles an hour winds and then 30 within 36 hours. And you know, we used to call and, and uh, you can see Dave up on the on the roof there. We used to call sometimes a, a category one storm a, a minor storm, but we don't do that anymore because they can cause a lot of damage and for rain. It can cause a lot of impacts for us, Dave. They really can and you know of late here we've had some strong category one hurricanes and this is nothing just you know bad an eye at and if we do have one ever coming our way it's not one of these we're like ah, we'll just stay here you need to pay close attention especially with the amount of rain we can get in even the pretty good storm surge with a category one hurricane as well fortunately nothing like that to speak of out there right now which is some good news the tropics are quiet this weekend but we are going to be talking more about the heat and humidity as we move forward this morning already starting off here with less cloud of cover that we did yesterday and that means a lot of sunshine today back in the 90s out there and that heat index can be really high in the 100s this afternoon. Take a look. You'll see currently 81.